we don't want to be a part of this story any longer. Dick Sporting Goods announced it will no longer sell assault style rifles at any of its stores. The retail chain will also stop selling high capacity magazines and will not sell firearms to anyone under 21 years old. Chairman and CEO Edward Stack says the company needed to take a stand following the Florida school shooting. We were so disturbed and, and, and saddened by what happened in Parkland that we said we need to do something. While some are praising the company's decision. Good for Dick Sporting Goods. I'm very glad more of us in the community need to do everything we can to stop this nonsense. Others don't see the benefit. I completely disagree with it. Either way, there's going to be a black market for anything. Drugs are illegal. People still find a way to get those, taking them off the shelves. It's not only going to make people mad, but it's pointless. And say this isn't the right approach. Well, I like that they're being proactive, but I think it's the wrong act. John Watkins disagrees. He says, while it isn't a complete fix, it's part of a larger movement. I'm very glad they're doing that. I think everything we do to get assault weapons out of schools, everything we do is very important and urgent. Still, not everyone thinks guns are the problem. People have fun shooting them and like, it just depends on how you use it. Watkins says he's not against all guns. Well, I'm all for hunters. I'm not against guns, but assault style war weapons should stay in the hands of soldiers. Others say the conversation shouldn't be about the guns themselves, but the policies surrounding them. It should be harder to get a gun rather than taking them away. Stack says he knew the company's decision would have backlash, but they couldn't ignore the pleas from those impacted by the Florida shooting. If these kids are brave enough to organize and do what they're doing, then we should be brave enough to take the stand. And that's what we've done. In Vestal, Chloe Vincenti, 12 News.